Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to a new video on the channel. Today in, the ta in today's video, we're going to talk about how to make a screenshot in the Android Mi Box and how to put it on other places, for instance, like Dropbox. Stay tuned. <laughs> Here we are in the Android start screen of the Mi Box and we are going to make a screenshot of the weather app Yo Window. Push down and hold the standby button on the remote and choose screenshot and it will be saved automatically in the map screenshots, in this case here on the USB stick. Then you can go to a file explorer, here explore, to see where it is saved. Here it is saved in the screenshot map, but to make it a little more clear, I'm going to delete everything in that map and do the process again. I have to mention here that you can only make a screenshot via this method if you upgrade it to the latest Android version that is available for the Mi Box. So everything is deleted and the map is empty now. We quit the app now and go to another interesting screen as an example to make a copy from. First, we do a copy of the start screen and here it is and we can enlarge it and look into the different details just without any editing software. Sorry for the flickering, it is from the converting process from the app team viewer that didn't go flawless this time. Quit the app again and scroll through the apps to search for another interesting screen to show the screen copy process. In the meantime, you can see here the app TeamViewer that is doing the streaming for the box to my PC screen and is recording this process here. You can only use it for free if it is for non-commercial purposes. But when you earn money here, you have to buy it. Okay, let's go to the file launcher and let's take a screenshot of the apps on the screen. Then quit the app and go to the explore again and search the screenshot in the right map. And here it is indeed and we can magnify it also. Quit the app again. And let's go to YouTube. For obvious copyright reasons, I will go to my own channel and try to make a copy there. You see that you can only make a screen copy of the photos, but not of a video. 
that screen will always be empty or black and I think it's for copyright reasons that this is made impossible to do. I'm sure there are apps that can do this nevertheless. So if any of you guys out there know how to do that, please let me know in the comment section below. You see, when I go to a video of mine, the video is invisible, but the thumbnails surely are. And on the screenshot it is the same thing. To show this, we quit YouTube, go to Explore, and to the right map again, and there it is, with the same black screen and the thumbnails. So this is again a wrap for this video guys, hope you liked it, please, if you do, please subscribe and leave a comment if you have something to ask, I will always reply. So as always, thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one, bye.